with reserve requirements eliminated what reason banks have to not approve every loan. Quoting Wikipedia, on March 16, 2020, amid an economic crisis caused by the 2020 coronavirus pandemic, for the first time since the inception of the Federal Reserve, the fractional reserve requirement was reduced to 0%, 11. Now question is why would banks not approve a loan? Worst case they get $0 back, but that does not mean that they lost money since credit was created out of thin air so even if every credit defaults they still will not lose any money and anything they get back is pure profit. Note, for simplification this assumes that cost of processing a loan is 0% for bank, we know that realistically they need to pay their employees. Worst case they get $0 back, but that does not mean that they lost money since credit was created out of thin air so even if every credit defaults they still will not lose any money and anything they get back is pure profit. Obviously if a bank never lost money by not getting paid back they would make loans all day long, even ones they knew they would not get paid back on. But the fact of the matter is, a bank's profits are based on how much they actually make on the loan beyond the cost of the loan itself. The cost of the loan includes the principal which must be paid back. What you refer to as being created out of thin air doesn't mean that money is being created from nothing, it is referring to the fact that the same money can be loaned out multiple times, effectively creating what appears to be actual money several times in excess of the actual amount of money floating around. Another way of looking at it is that a bank generally isn't lending its own money. They get the money from other sources and lend it out at higher rates than they pay, and from the excess they pay their expenses and hopefully have some profits left over. So if you put $100 in an account at the bank, the bank can lend that $100 out and earn interest on the money, but at the end of the day, they still owe you $100 on demand whenever you ask for it. The created out of thin air comes from the fact that the person who lends the money will need to put the money somewhere, most likely either the same or a different bank, or if they use the money to pay somebody else, that person most likely will deposit the same money in the bank, so ultimately, most of the money they lend out stays in the banking system where it can be lent out again. The fractional reserve requirement just states how much of that money can be lent out again in the aggregate. A 0% reserve requirement basically means the bank can lend it all out again. It doesn't mean that they will be able to only so much money in loans is being sought at any given time, nor does it reduce the fiduciary requirements to make good loans that are likely to get paid back.